three, two, one, go! It's time for qualification match number 80 over here on the Curie Subdivision. Team Thrust lining up, trying to place a hatch panel on front of the ship for the Red Alliance. Meanwhile, 15-19 Mechanical Mayhem trying to place their second for Blue on the rocket. It's now time for a teleoperated period where the teams can now see the entirety of the field. Team Thrust headed over. They're gonna try first to fill up the cargo ship for the Red Alliance. They have a very supportive cheers section showing that even in Indiana, if you move your way up, you will have a crowd supporting you. They've got a second one, 4296 also lining up, working the other side of the cargo ship for the Red Alliance. Meanwhile, on the blue side of the field, Mechanical Mayhem is working on building a rocket for the Blue Alliance. They've got four of the hatch panels on. They're now headed over for a fifth. Gale Force has been working on filling up the ship for the Blue Alliance as well. Even up against Bot Raiders, they're trying to stop Gale Force by playing some really heavy defense on them. 15-19 placing the last hatch panel they need onto the rocket. Now they can start filling it up with cargo. We have 65 seconds left in this match. Team Thrust trying to get another hatch panel onto the rocket. They've got it. 4296 Trident Robotics is also trying to place hatch panels onto the Red Alliance's rocket. However, the Green Hills lawnmower is playing defense and making their job very difficult. Notice how the lawnmowers are going back and forth. That's because they don't want to incur any sort of pinning penalty, which you won't receive if you back up six feet away from the rocket or from the robot you're playing defense against. 25 seconds left in the match. Mechanical Mayhem needs three more cargo in the rocket in order to complete it for the Blue Alliance. They've got two more left now, 15 seconds left. Team Thrust lining up, a, going to attempt a level three climb. Mechanical Mayhem needs one more piece of cargo to finish it. However, their partner is coming over. They've got it in 126 Gale Force completing the rocket for the Blue Alliance. 1501 is up and so is Mechanical Mayhem with seconds to spare, pulling out a level three hab climb right at the last second. Eight to 82 and also earned four ranking points. Even with that yellow card, congratulations to all three of these robots who will be moving up in the rankings. Mechanical Mayhem up to the number nine position. The Red Alliance only earned one.